It was a beautiful morning to do just about anything outdoors, but today dozens of volunteers chose to chip in and help fix up the home of a widow. And at the same time, their efforts also helped a different family adopt a child. Nine News reporter Jonathan Gonzalez explains how one organization in, is making this all happen. Hey, girl. Hi. Oh, you're helping Jean, right? There may not have been a nicer day. Oh, I know. Yes, I'm. I mean, we couldn't have asked for better yeah. weather. Like, to help someone in need. I am sanding a spindle for Miss Pam's porch. She is a widow that we are helping to serve today. Volunteers are fixing up Miss Pam's home today. She lives here in Broomfield. She lost her husband a couple years ago from fungal pneumonia. Because Ashley and, uh, Johnson has asked them to. We saw this project, and as soon as we saw it, we said, this is what we need to do. Ashley and her husband. Do it. Adam Johnson. Awesome. <laughs> are paying it forward after all these people helped them raise money recently towards adopting a child overseas. There are so many awesome kids in the world that are just looking for families and deserve those families. Mm -hmm. And in return, they promised their donors they would help out a widow. It's part of a nonprofit called Both Hands. It's kind of like what we would be doing, like a 5K or a golf tournament, something along those lines where you get people to sponsor you. It looks like you need to adjust it one degree. Oh, I'm just kidding. Oh, I'm just the Johnsons once thought about doing a silent auction to raise money for their adoption. But they realized they could still get the money and help others all at once. A lot of great people here today. Their hearts are really the, the heartbeat of this whole project, if you will. Let's see if I can go as deep as possible. Where, why aren't you inside orange peeling? And as for who they'll adopt. We don't know. It's a surprise. <laughs> in Broomfield, Jonathan Gonzalez, 9 News. A lot of paying it forward happening there. Love that. Well, Miss Pam didn't want to speak on camera, but says that she was grateful for all of the work done today. The family raised roughly $7,000 for their adoption and another $1,000 toward today's repairs. Other companies also chipped in money and labor.